A game of thunder, smoke and dust, color, energy and spectacle. It is called the Moroccan Fantasia. A test of handling and training a horse and the rider's ability to coordinate his gestures and to be precise. The horsemen, when galloping, was all at a signal, aim their rifles towards the ground and fire. The Fantasia opened up the annual Tantan -tan Museum here on the west coast of Morocco. Just one of the many attractions that draw people here from across the Sahara. In fact, this is the largest gathering of nomadic tribes in northern Africa to exhibit traditional elements of Berber life. The week-long event is recognized by the UN Cultural Agency UNESCO as an intangible heritage of humanity. For participants, it's a chance to forge new friendships and revive old ones to swap stories and songs, trade, marry even, and of course, to race their horses and camels. Most of the Tantan Museum is about cherishing a way of life. Here in downtown Tantan, thousands took part in a parade, in a vivid demonstration of traditional clothing, music, and culture. And I'm in Tantan. I am from Tantan. This is my home. I am happy to see everything going on here. The Tantan Mosim is a lot of fun. It has so many colorful activities. It's great. The first museum was organized in 1963. It was suspended for 25 years until 2004 because of security problems. Now the festival is playing an important role for the Bedouin. Their lifestyle is being profoundly altered by economic development and urbanization. Many of nomads are being forced to settle, and the craft and the poetry and the know-how of centuries are being lost. So alongside the celebrations, the color and the spectacle, Tan Tan Museum is helping to keep a culture alive. Liao Liao, CCTV, Tantan, Western Morocco.